Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. Do you a quick tour of everything that I did since the last video, which is not much. I slapped a roof on top of my house because there's like literally four pieces and then the front little blocks that go on top of there. And let's see, I have my bed. I made myself a nightstand and a little candle, which requires zero effort to do. Uh, Olaf's still standing in the corner and I got rid of my campfire on accident. So I made myself a actual stove and that's it. That's literally all I did. You've missed absolutely nothing. So one of the, th oh, hang on. It's got to do it under manual crafting. One of the things I did want to make before we go do the next thing is I need to make some arrows and, uh, let me see. How many do I make at a time? Plus 10, plus 20, 30, 40. How about 50 arrows? That sounds good. Let's make sure I have all those on me. Open this up. 50 arrows and we have our bow down here. Let's see. I'm going to put my, is this, that's a pickaxe, axe, torch, bandages, food. Let me put my food down here and put my bow up here. That way I can access it a little bit quicker. There we go. All right. So when you get Olaf in here, your blacksmith, and you talk to him the first time, he's going to give you the option to craft, and he gives you two little dialogue options. Both of those dialogue options open up the next areas where you need to go. You got the elixir well, which is where we're going to head today, and then this rookmore, which I don't know what that is. He basically... I think that's where he sent me to. Anyway, this is the one he sent me to first of, haha, go destroy the elixir well because the elixir well is what um, causes the shroud to spread. Oh, the other thing I wanted to make, the other thing I wanted to make, is it a standard crafting or is it a other thing? Hang on, where's it at? Glider, that's what I was going to make because it makes it a tremendous amount easier to get there. So one of the things I do like is that you can pin this and it shows the crap that you need over there. Shroud wood, animal fur, string, and shroud spores. I don't see how much of this I already have on me. See, shroud spores I have, animal fur I have. I don't know if I have any shroud wood, but I can get that from literally just going inside the shroud and getting some. And string I can make as long as I have stuff. There's regular wood. Okay, uh, let's see. Can I make regular string? I need more plant fibers, which I may have in here. Let's see. I do have. Okay, so we can make a couple things of string, and that'll... There we go. That seems pretty good. All right, so all we have left to do is to get some shroud wood. So we just got to head into the shroud, chop down a tree, and we should be good. And I think there's one right over here. But I like my little, ha I like my little cabin. Um, one of my longtime friends and regulars, uh, Strange Tart, thinks that I should name it the uh, Fort Freckle. And I think I'm okay with that. I think Fort Freckled works pretty good. Sorry, dude. I gotta do it. You dead. Uh-uh. Okay, you seem to be kind of chill with me just beating your A down here. That's fine. That's fine. Cool, cool. Some more shroud spores and some torn cloth. Cool, I can use that. And, okay, so that's all stuff I need. Alright, I need to find a tree that's inside the enshrouded thing. I don't think you get anything besides... Yeah, you just get twigs from these. Alright, let's see. Uh, if not, I can... Wait, hang on. These trees... Wait, what is this? Yeah, that looks like a, a nope for the moment. What's making all this goopy sound? Hey, that sounds nasty. You know what it sounds like to me? Well, the first thing that comes to mind is it sounds like the swamp that they had to walk through in the movie Labyrinth, where every time they stepped on one of the lo uh, the little stones to pass by, it made the farting sound. One of the funniest parts of my childhood was laughing my butt off at that. Because I'm a guy and his little kid, you know, all that sort of stuff. It was funny. Uh, all right, so you're not a shroud tree because you're a regular. I need to find a shroud area that has some trees so I can chop them down to get some shrouded wood. Maybe this will work. Maybe. I'm not sure if this counts as a tree. Let's see here. Do you count? Uh-uh. Okay, that's just wood log, so you don't even count as shroud wood. All right, so this is just a broken tree. I'm sorry, dude. I know you're kind of busy and you're doing your thing, and I appreciate the effort, but I'm not in the mood to deal with you right now. I'm looking for some shrouded wood. Now, I know I can just run down inside this little valley here and get some, but I was hoping I'd be able to get some at the house a little bit quicker. And I realized that by the time I make a glider to try and save me some time to get across all of this, that I could have just ran all the way over there. I'm aware. I'm aware. But it's the principle of the thing. Know what I mean? That's a lore book over there we already got. 
Well, guys, while you're here, thank you very, very much for all the support on the first video. Truly do appreciate it. It's always, it's always, uh, it's always a challenge bringing new types of games or new games entirely to a channel. And uh, so I appreciate everybody who's checked it out and watched it. And thank you very, very much. If you're here and you're watching this one and you enjoy it, well, do me a favor and leave a like on it. It helps out a lot. And uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. If you're playing the game, if you're enjoying it. There we go. Your shroud. Uh-uh. Hey, I said, uh-uh. I said, uh-uh. Get you all the way up and... Yaw! That's my power attack that I got. It's more torn cloth. What you got? You missed, sir. These zombies remind me... <laughs> Did anybody ever see the movie? I'm sure a lot of you did. What was it called? Uh, let me see. Adam Sandler movie. Uh, Hotel Transylvania. <laughs> Adam Sandler and um, Andy Samberg and Selena Gomez. All that sort of stuff. Anyway. Wait, where'd the tree go? Anyway, those zombies, the way they kind of grown up there, sounds like the zombies that work in the hotel there. Every time Drac tells them to do something they don't want to do and they're just you know, slowly groaning. It just kind of sounds like that. So we need six more pieces of shroud wood. Do you count as shroud wood? You do. All right, that takes us to six. Fortunately, there we go. Fortunately, this is not a really difficult recipe to get. So to be able to get the fabled glider early on. Wait, what are you? What was that? What did I walk over here to give me a prompt? I don't even see it now. That's some epic music starting to fire up there. Uh, why do I feel like this is just a regular tree? I've got enough to make the glider, but I'm trying to get just a little bit more because I have a feeling I'm going to get back home and be like, dang it, now I need six or something. So there we go. We're a little bit on the plus side of things. I can get up out the shroud. We can get home, make ourselves a glider, and then we can save ourselves a whole lot of time. Home sweet home. That was a short little trip. I do like how frequently the twigs and little bushes and everything around here respawn so you can, you know, use it as a pretty easy source and stuff. You don't have to keep dragging so far out there that it's become such a pain. Craft and let me see. A grappling hook. We need metal scraps and string. Do I have any metal scraps? It'd be useful to have one of those. Metal scraps. I do. Oh, nice. And let me see. I can make some more string. Oops, wrong button. String. Boom, boom. Pow, pow, I can get you and go ahead and get the grappling hook. Oh, crap, I need one more. Okay, I miscounted. There we go. Grappling hook and boom, crafted. All right, so now what I need to do is you go into your character, your backpack extensions, not that. Uh, it's this over here, grappling hook in there, boom, and glider there, boom. So now when you get ready to do your grapple thing, you look up where it says to grapple and uh, you just click the little button and you're good to go. All right, let me put all of this stuff over here real quick. All right, let's see. How are we on food and water? We're doing okay. I need to pop a quick squat right here just to kind of get my, oh, okay, well, I'm already rested because I'm sitting at home. Okay, let's do it. Let's go over and see if we can't take this guy out. We're going to take the shortcut because the shortcut is the most fun way to do it. Where are we at? We're heading right down to that little tower there. So let's do it. Ready? Uh, it's less flying and more falling with style. <laughs> but it's still a hell of a lot of fun. I mean, this is this like when I saw that the first time in some sort of trailer, that was like, well, that's the first thing I got to do. He did. He dead. Torn cloth and shroud spears. All right, we got a couple more we have to do within here. There's not too many here. Uh, this at least, I, hey, just a couple of you at a time here. Okay, just one at a time. We'll go to one at a time. Let's do like fighting moves where everybody just kind of dances around and doesn't do anything until, you know, one at a time attacking here. That's the way we need to do this. Okay, he's dead and he's dead. Nice. Get some more torn cloth. That's all you seem to have on you is just a bunch of torn cloth, but it's okay. Dude hits hard. Dude hits real hard. Okay, so we need to switch over to our bow here. Uh, actually, let me see if I can use a bandage real quick. Get a little bit of health back in there. That doesn't do a lot for me. Uh, let's see. How about some food? That'll give me a decent chunk. I got some more grilling. That'll get that going up a little bit more. Okay. Okay, sir. 
We need you to just calm down. Location is above. Make sure this is activated. And that didn't do a lot of damage, but... Oh, dude's got bombs! Okay, standing next to this little ball here, besides getting the little tooltip stuck in your way. Alright, that's working a little bit. Alright, that is working a little bit. We're gonna have, we're just uh, cheese it up. Uh oh! He's got a bow too, careful. I'm gonna guess being purple means that he is a level that's slightly higher than us. It doesn't look... Hey! Quit it, man. I'm gonna guess that uh, you can't hold your arrow knocked for too terribly long. Got him! Did you like it, huh? What you got on you? Uh, pine short bow. Hang on, I hear... It sounds like something else is growling at me. All right, we need to stay right to this because this refills it here. All right, is your bow that you just gave me... Let me see, what do you do? 10 power, 8 power. 10 power, 10 power. Okay, so this one's definitely better. Let's put you over here and just slap you in the backpack so we can access you. That'll help out a little bit. And let's see, I do have a little bit more food on me. Let's get this in here. That'll... Oh, food type is already active. I could eat some mushrooms and that would definitely get me tripping balls, I'm sure. Just throw another bandage on, get that health going back up a little bit. How about we'll pop a squat right here? We don't have any warmth and we're not comfortable, but we at least uh, get a chance for everything kind of calm down for a second and get our health to go back up. There we go. Okay, this is going to be, uh, it's going to be something. Okay, where do I go? Uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh. What was that? Who's growling at me? Where you is? Okay, there you are over there. I don't think I need to be here. Reach. Oh, I'm inside. Oh, I know where I'm at. How do I get in there? Let's go. Yeah, this way. Okay. Surely they're not going to follow me down here. This, I do know where I'm at right the moment here. Because this is where me and Josh went in. So I do know what to expect here. I do remember this little spot. There's a whole lot that I don't remember. And some of it's new, of course. But this one, I do remember. We got... Wait, not over there. We got to look in the wrong direction. We got that thing right up in there that we got to deal with. I'm hoping this works. I'm hoping this works and that I can do some um, dodging and that I don't die when we get up in here. If we die, it's okay. We're not doing a permadeath series. We're having fun here. It's no big deal. But we're definitely trying not to as long as possible. All right, sir. You are... It's time to be vanquished. Go ahead and use another bandage real quick. Get that health all the way up. Hold on, make sure there's nobody else around. All right. Are you ready? You ready to do this? Okay. Uh, I'm going to assume you don't have any kind of ranged attack. Uh oh. Okay, you don't have a ranged attack right this second, at least. So I can sit here and just plink you with arrows from a distance. Get you to attack. Uh oh. Hey, you're not attacking. You're supposed to. Stop chasing me! Okay, we're doing this. Fail Thunderbird. No! Oh, oh crap, I got hung up on a tiny hole. We stepped on a pothole. I'm glad you can lock onto the enemy, because I lost him for a second in this shrouded cloud in here. Uh-oh. I don't know how many stamina. Get the stamina back. Right, little ring around the rosy here. Owie! That hurt, sir. Dude tried to straight kick me. Oh, hell, he's got an earthquake thing. He don't need range when he can do that. Oh, hell, no. Keep running out of stamina. Okay, get your stamina back. Get your stamina back. You got this. You're okay. Hold on. Let's uh, use... Oh, hell, you got to stop to use a bandage? That ain't cool. You need to heal on the run, sir. I keep falling in that one little hole that's over there, too. I'm going to cause some problems. Okay, just spam the barrels. Spam the arrows. He's almost dead. Got him. Yes. First try. Give me your stuff. What you got on your fell Thunderbrute head? I'm going to wear that. Runes and a bronze sword. It's definitely better than this crap sword that I'm rocking. I'm going to chop down this shroud root. Yeah, yeah. And we got a skill point. Look at that. Look at that. We cleared the, sh we cleared the, uh, we cleared the thingy. Cleared the shroud. It is cleared, baby. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to use another bandage real quick. 
I want to see what we got here. This this sword that you gave us. That one does 14 damage versus our rusty short sword. Sure, we'll go ahead and swap to you. What are you? Fell Thunderbrute Head. Oh, so it's not like an armor thing. Shroud Core, stable. Burning it in the flame altar may protect you against the shroud. Well, yeah, we definitely need to do that. What do we have over here? Oh, yeah, that's straight into Mordor. We're not going in there. We did it! We took down the brute. See, this is the hole I fell into when I was running from it. I just like, duh, got stuck. Uh oh. Hang on. Did w w Okay, well, it looks like we're going to have to do the old fast travel. Because that elixir well is done. And fast travel. Sweet, we made it home. Hey, you. Hey, I did it. Scaling the ancient spire. Embervale has changed. Before our time, a race of ancients built towers to survey the land. The ancient spires. One is close by. Climb it and discover the world anew. Ooh. I want to go climb the tower. Hold on, where's that at? Are you the tower? Oh, hang on. The ancient tower. Is this it? Yep. Okay, that's, that's, that's a little bit of a trek to get over there. This is about as far as we've been so far. But that's okay. That's okay. I can drop some of this stuff off that we just got. If I have room for it. I probably should make me some more bandages. You know, just seems like a good idea. Torn cloth and strings, we just got a bunch of. So I definitely need to get the torn cloth that we have there. And I think I have some more plant fibers right there. So I can just make some more strings. All right. Now, bandages, one, two, three. Okay, that'll give me three of those. That's not terrible. I should probably get some more meat, some more foods in here. Just because, you know, I'm going to end up taking a whole lot of damage when we accidentally fall off this tower. And I'm probably going to need to be able to repair, you know, my legs a little bit. I have nothing to cook on me. I have one. Can you cook a mushroom? Hang on. Can you just straight cook it? You can. I wonder what cooking a mushroom does for you in terms of anything bad. Because I'm just, I don't know, call me crazy, but eating a mushroom doesn't sound like it's going to be good. Plus two intelligence. And that one helps out your constitution? You know what? Let's eat a shroom and see how intelligent we get. Hang on. Con commune with the flame. Ember can be claimed. Collect sparks and offer to them the flame altar to strengthen the flame. Sparks lie scattered around the world. Oh, hold on. We got to do that real quick. Strengthen the flame. We need to strengthen the flame here. This is so the uh, spark. That's what we just got. Shroud liquid. I have some of that. I might have all this. We're not going to... Wait, can I? Hold on. Can I uh, pin you? Let's see. Resin. Red. I don't think I have enough of that. I don't think I have enough of that right at the moment. Uh, let's get a good sleep in real quick. And then we're going to go over and find out this other tower. Sleep. I'm not, no, um, hey, you're not, you're not sleeping, sir. Sleep. There we go. There's daylight. Olaf just standing there watching me here the whole time. Did you forget about weaponry? Oh, yeah, I forgot. In order to be able to craft stuff with him, the next thing I'm going to have to get him to do for me is I got to make a forge and a charcoal kiln. That is something that we will do at a different time. I don't want to right now. We are going to head over to right here, the ancient spires. It's going to take a minute to get there. Let me see. Create or set a waypoint. That way I can see which direction I'm going. We got a little ways to run to get over there. Hey, can I harvest just straight harvest you without the bees getting all pissy? And I believe I could just straight eat the honey. Stamina replenishment increased. I need to grab all the red mushrooms I can find along the way too. So I can get across the bridge now that I have my grappling hook. That'll save me a little bit of time running. And I think, I'm not mistaken, but I think that we might come across some loot wire over there too. I'm wondering if that is going to be kind of like a Assassin's Creed thing or Far Cry, either one of those, where you climb the tower, you look around and ta-da, it opens up the map and reveals new locations and things like that. That could be kind of cool. Oh, that's just sweet. Hang on, let me switch back over to sword just in case there's, get off the ladder. Anything over here that I need to whoop up on? You have anything in you? Water, plant fibers, and woodlocks. Nice. Pretty simple. I appreciate it. Look at all this 
fog and shroud, we got to clear up all that. We're going to have to find a whole lot more elixir wells so we can clear this land of all of this atrocities here. Sure, plant fibers, I'll take those too. All right, tiptoe across the tower. Let's not do anything too dumb. Hey, dude, you look like you're having problems. Metal scraps, explosive powder balls, and torn cloth. Thank you. And I'll take your arrow. Sweet. Okay, I think I can make that. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's try to get it. Ready? Dude, would you jump? You maroon. Ah, there we go. <laughs> I don't need you to climb down so you can jump across and climb back up. Oh, hell. Stupid. We freaking glided directly into a trap. <laughs> I was trying to avoid that. But, uh, okay, pro tip. Um, the glider controls are inverse. So if you hold W, you like, uh, angle downward and nosedive. And I was holding W because I was running forward and yeah, we did all kinds of dumb things. <laughs> I wonder if that's the super duper, duper tall tower that we're going to be trying to climb. It kind of looks like it might be. Are we already there? Uh, it's that one. The ancient spire. Cool. All right, um, that's where we went to get the uh, guy that's currently uh, working for us here, the blacksmith. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm not sorry. I need the experience and you're made of meats. Oh, uh, hang on, let me see. I don't need you, or how do I clear what's pinned? Okay, let me just do that. I still had the glider pinned from a moment ago. We definitely took the roundabout way to get here. Let me guess. I'm going to have to go in through here. Or up and around here. Just like that, baby. Oh, hey, to What you up to, dude? How about you stop shooting me? How about it, huh? Dude, I got some ups. Dude's rocking around some me uh, meat on him here. Yaw! Got him. I wonder if this is the route I'm supposed to go. If I'm over here just beating all these dudes butt in and killing them all and I'm not even supposed to be here. It's going to be like, uh, no, you didn't need to murder that entire village. A crackling wand. Mono regenerations, overcharge, attack speed. It's a mid-range weapon. It's my wand. Some more lore if you want to read some of that. Cool. Okie dokie. Let's see. How do I go about climbing up this place? How is it? Oh, it's a winding path to go around. Okay. All right. Well, let's start making our way up this hill here. All right, what do we got over here? Got the little glowing thing, so I'm going to assume there's some sort of lore. This dude's straight dead. Another explosive. Cool. Appreciate you bringing a, a babamba to me. Uh, what you got? Sure, I'll take your campfire. I might want to stop and eat something here now that I'm getting some random meats laying around, some mushrooms. I need to not cook all the mushrooms because I'm going to need those for the super secret recipe. Wait, can I go up that way? That's the way I'm supposed to go, yes. Go around that way, and I'm taking the long way back to the other side. Then I'll be like, oh, man. I went the wrong way. What are the odds this is going to be just a stroll in, look around, ta-da, here's the world around you, and not some horribly terrible spot? Ancient Spire. We're in the right spot. What are the odds this place is absolutely overrun with bad guys and things? Ancient spire. These spires stretch to the firmament and deny the firmament. Isn't that the lowest part? Health potion. Oh, thank you. You know what? I'll go ahead and use you. I'll go ahead and use you. Get that all the way back up just in case what I was saying is true and we get inside and things are bad. The firmament. Isn't that... Okay, so for people that believe, like, not really the hollow earth theory specifically, but for people that believe, like, the bottom of the Marianas Trench... Um, is a realm to another planet or whatever they think that it's uh, the firmament is the 
cloud that we can see. What are we doing? Oh, we're floating. Okay. Wax. Okay, that's a weird thing to keep inside a little thingy, but sure, sure, sure. What do you got? Wisp of light? Cool. Hang on, I should probably use something like, you know, not take the degradate. Well, that does not do that much damage. Water, water everywhere, not a drop to drink. Actually, how is my water? Water is empty. Let's get some water in us. There we go. Food's getting a little low. There we go. Uh, our sword seems to actually do the most damage to these things, so I'm just going to... Calm down. You're going to get into a combo and actually run off a cliff or something here in a minute. Water, wax, health potion. Yeah, yeah. Giving me all that good stuff. How do I get up there? What are you? Some doors are locked, but can be opened by finding and pressing the correct button. Are you the correct button? I'm guessing you're the correct button since you opened the door. How high am I up here now? Oh, wow. Um, we're a little ways up, but we're not as, we're not as high up as we can go. Sweet. Yeah, so I'm going to be real curious as if this place is occupied. There's going to be some sort of battle at the top. Oh, nice. That's a nice hatchet. Is it better than the one I'm rocking? Probably. See, this one is 11 damage. This one is 14. This one's an uncommon versus this one is just a meh common. Commoners. Yeah. Uh, I feel like I need to break you. A stone. Okay, I didn't need to break you. Oh, there's stairs right there. Sort of. Oh, there's actual stairs right here. Duh. Let's miss these super de duper easy to see spots. More wax. Okay. Um, now what? Do I use you again? Hold on, what did that say? Uh, let's see, does that just take me back to where I was at? Or is it like it goes up and then just keeps going up? Let's see. Nope, that takes us back down to where we were. Alright, so this is how you get to the middle part of that. Let's go back up here and take a look around. Is there... Some, I don't think there's anything up there. Even if I... Even if I did use, like, my glider or something and tried to jump across over there, I don't think I could make it to begin with, but I don't think there's anything over there. Oh, there's a grappling hook. I don't need to. Open sesame. There we go. So, it's not even that challenging. I'm making it way harder than it needs to be. Fair enough, fair enough. I'm going to go ahead and break all of this because why not? I'm new here. I'm just going to assume all of this is for me and that nobody minds me breaking all their ancient pottery. I'll leave your bench alone. That just seems kind of mean to do that. That looks like a... Yep, that's absolutely a trap. So don't fall off that. And that'll take us up to the next area. Sweet. Yeah, this is damaging our sword a little bit, but... A mana potion! We're going to be casting some magic before no time, and then we won't need a sword. Wait, what do you, where do you go? You take me down... Ooh, a chest and everything. Okay. Gather up all of that. What do we got in here? Another health potion. Nice game. Wait a second. When in any game does when it starts loading you up with health potions, that means good things are happening. Never. Something bad's about to happen. Cap's about to get absolutely wrecked. Aren't you? Yep, you are. Uh, I'm not going to... Yeah. I needs it. I might as well. I've already started. There's no reason not... Oh, you're just giving me rocks now. All right, no super dra dramatic music or anything yet. That looks like a place we need to go, but I can't grapple over there, so I'll probably have to climb up that, jump over, and ta-da, a little bit of parkour. 
Oh, hey, game. That's not cool. Is there stairs right here? There is. All right, let's run around this way and see what we can find to loot before. Oh, let me guess. There's a button that I have to get to right up there, and that opens up this door. Yeah. Easy peasy. So far. Easy peasy so far. Oh, okay. Maybe I don't have to push a button? Hey, do you have any buttons over here? Alright, I didn't break this bench. That one wasn't me, okay? Um, I, I cannot take credit for that. That was broke when I got here. Looks like some people just went absolutely wrecked some stuff in here. Can I just... If I pop a squat here, does it raise... No. Because I'm not warm or anything here. Up to the next level. Well, that looks fun. How high are we now? We're a little, we're a little ways up. A little ways up. All right, is this a timing thing? I can close you, but that would be pointless. Yeah, that's uh, instant death. That does not stay there long enough to not die. All right, let's see. There's got to be a way to go around this. Careful. Dude, we have... we. Oh, don't do it, Captain. Now, you want to. I can see that you want to. How far do these spikes go over? All the way, and you get like one and a half seconds here. Is there something I'm... Something I'm missing? What am I... What am I missing here? There's got to be something I can climb? Or... <laughs> don't don't do it. Don't jump off. As much as you keep thinking you want to, don't do it. How do I get up from here? Okay, so I can't jump long enough to stay above the spikes. I'm trying to see if there's anything over on that side, maybe. I definitely can't run fast enough to get over there, I don't think. Nope, that covers, like, the whole room over there. So even if I did a run, jump, duck, dodge, dip, dive, and dodge. What am I missing? Okay, so you want me to come out here. I don't know why. A metal block. Oh, nice. I don't have to make one of those. Well, yeah, dude, that's just the recipe. Never mind. There's got to be a hidden button somewhere that I'm missing that, like, turns that off. Well, hang on. I backtracked just a little bit. All right, so the little wall I had to climb to go over to jump that direction. I went left this time, and look, there's this thing right up here. Some barrels made to shoot arrows to activate them. So I went basically just, whoops, wrong direction. No ammo. Are you serious? I don't have any ammo. Really? I used all of them? Wait, can I use you? That worked. Well, at least that opened that door. I don't know what else is up here, but maybe it's what we're supposed to get here. Shepherd's lightning. Okay. My inventory is getting rather full. Really rather full. I'm shooting a teeny tiny little thing at him. Little itty bitty. So anyway, uh, from where I was at here, if you're, whoa, calm down. Yeah, that's good, let's fall off. See what I was talking about earlier about falling? All right, so what I did was I jumped over here last time to climb this, and then I went that way, go up that direction. That's where that other chest is. I have to assume that I did, there's okay, God. Sometimes your ups are a little too much there, Chief. I'm assuming there's something like that that I have to activate in this next room to turn the spikes off or to delay the spikes or something, and I just missed it. So that's where I need to go to get up. Let me look around and make sure there's nothing else in here that links to that. Oh, that's how the door opened. Okay. That's how that door opened. Uh, I'm going to guess that that's probably not it. Whether well, it's a puzzle. It's a puzzle we gotta figure out. Is there, hold on, let me see if there's a spot where there's not any spikes. That would be kind of useful. Oh, hell, not there. I was a little, little too close, a little, little too close. Uh, let me see, I've got a couple health potions. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Can I, here, let me just move you down here. What are you? Wisp of Light. An improve, improvised wisp of light opening the flash releases glowing wisp that lights the darkness. Oh, that's kind of cool. And you're a mana potion. Potion restores a good amount of mana. That's good. Explosives is not going to help us right now. We need some health. Okay, I cannot figure out how to do that. There's so the glare coming in from that lighting is a little bit rough. I'm not gonna lie. I do not see anything. Hang on, at least not from right here. I have no ammo anyway. If I wanted to use that bow. Okay, let's see how bad this goes here. Oh. Okay, I was being a chicken for nothing. For nothing. I could have just ran over there. Y'all don't make fun of me, okay? There's no need for any of that. No need for making fun of me for any of that. That looks fun. I'm going to guess that I can't get in this other door over here, right? Okay, never mind. I keep saying things and then those things uh, appear to be wrong. Oh, I totally got to break you down. Okay, maybe I can't break that down since it's literally not breaking. I thought maybe I could, but no, clearly not. Hey, look, it's more spikes. <laughs> we found a button. What did you do? Ice bolt. Sweet. <laughs> Dong. I'm just assuming that that's what that is. Uh, let's see. I'm going to have to probably use magic because I don't have any arrows. Let's see. Can I? Whoa. Okay, aiming this is a little bit more challenging. Okay, so that actually hit that, but that didn't do anything. At least I got some serious ups, though. All right, so you just link back around to right here. All right, that's good. That's okay. So that's what I'm trying to figure out how to open. I'm going to guess that there I hit one of the buttons, but I got to go hit another one. Which, if I were to make a guess, it's going to be right over on this side. You can sprint jump to cover more distance sprint and taking run jump before jumping to land on seemingly out of reach platforms. Those don't even seem that far out of reach. And flint arrows. Nice. Thank you, game. Appreciate that. That's nice of you. All right. So I need to look and see. If there is, yeah, like that right there. Climb up here. Hey, come on, you big idiot. Okay, we got most of our health back. We got some food back. I'm going to try this one more time and then I'm going to be like, nah, I'm good. Because it's just, I mean, it's a treasure chest is what's up there. How about we go straight up right here? There we go. Don't know why it worked that time, but it did. You pain in the ass. You better be really worth it. I mean, like, really worth it. Forest Longbow. Let me see how worth it you were. Let's see real quick here. If you were absolutely worth it. The one we're using here is a 10. Forest Longbow is... That's... Hold on, where's our... Okay. 10. Draw speed is 1 second. That's 0.6. In fact, it's 250 max durability. Stamina cost is 15. Arrow speed. So... Uh, let me see. Fire magic damage. Increased critical chance by 5% and 2 fire damage. Okay, so you're a little better. And I didn't even open the chest when I did make it over the first time. Some more... Wait. Did I not? I swear I opened that chest. Alright, well, here we go. Let's uh, head up to the next area. See if we can do this without dying again. Uh, we're pretty close. To, I think we're at the tippy top. Look how, look how high we are. That's fantastic. Commune with the flame. Ah, ancient spires open fast travel points all over the world. Reveal ancient knowledge of Embervale. Venture forth, child. The land must be reclaimed. Nine new locations opened up here on the map. Oh. That's as far out as I can do zoom here. All right, so we've got Ancient Vault for the Carpenter, the Hunter, the Alchemist, the Farmer. Oh, nice. Nice. We got stuff. 
Oh, we got location stuff. I could fast travel back home, too. Uh, I do want to glance around and make sure I'm not missing anything first. You know, travel all the way up here and have a moment of complete dump, and we burned ourselves with lava quite badly, I might add. It's worth at least glancing around before I do anything else stupid. Doesn't look like there's anything up here. Well, at least we got some treasure along the way. All right, where is home from here? Home is... Home is way over here. Home is way over there. Let's see, what are the odds that we can... We're going to try to wingsuit down there, see how far we can make it towards home. i got to see which direction I'm going for. Okay, so there's the bridge right there, right at the edge of my head. Let's do it. La, 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 I'm a sugar glider. Got to pick up a little bit of speed. I don't know what our speed is here. I'm going to guess that I'm not even going to make it to the bridge. Can we do like a Top Gun here, get going real fast and then pull up? And I guess we have just kind of a single speed. That saves a lot of time, though. I can get back over to this bridge real close to the house. The Braylon Bridge. Okay, let's fall down here. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, all right. We communed with the flame. We can extinguish it, but that wouldn't be good. Strengthen the flame. We need to gather up all of this stuff here that we have that we can to get ready to do that next time. But that is going to do it for this video. That was fun. We vanquished a boss. Aye. We vanquished a boss. We climbed a tower. We had a moment of dumb, but we climbed a tower. We're doing good. We're doing good. I'm having a good time with this. And that's going to do it. We're going to get some more stuff. I need to get some more storage in this base because my inventory is full and my boxes are full too. But guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, leave a like on the video. If you're new, make sure you subscribe. Click the little bell so you get notified when videos go live. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. You guys have a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you later.